Welcome. Today the church celebrates the feast of the Nativity of the Blessed Virgin Mary. Our presider today is Father Frank. Let us, Let us celebrate, celebrate with, with joy, joy the, the Nativity, nativity of, of the Blessed Virgin Mary. For, for from, from her arose the Son of Justice, Christ, Christ our God. God. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. The grace and peace of God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ be with you. And with and your spirit. With your spirit. My brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate these sacred mysteries. You were sent to heal the contrite of heart. Lord, have mercy. Lord, Lord, have, have mercy. mercy. You came to call sinners. Christ, have mercy. Christ, Christ have, have mercy. mercy. You are seated at the right hand of the Father to intercede for us. Lord, have mercy. Lord, Lord have, have mercy. mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Amen. Glory to God, God in the in highest. The highest. And, and on earth, earth peace, peace to, to people of goodwill. We praise you, we bless you, we adore you, you we glorify you. We give you thanks for your great glory, Lord, Lord God, God, heavenly, heavenly King, King, O God, Almighty Father, Father Lord Jesus Christ, only begotten Son, Son, Lord God, God Lamb, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. You, you take away the sins, sins of the world. world. Receive our prayer. For you are seated at the right hand of the Father. Father. Have mercy, mercy on us. For you alone are the Holy One. You alone are the Lord. You alone are the Most High, Jesus Christ, with the Holy Spirit, in the glory of God the Father. Amen. Let us pray. Impart to your servants, we pray, O Lord, the gift of heavenly grace, that the feast of the Nativity of the Blessed Virgin may bring deeper peace to those for whom the birth of your Son was the dawning of salvation. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the book of the prophet Micah. The Lord says, You, Bethlehem, Ephrathah, too small to be among the clans of Judah, from you shall come forth for me, one who is to be ruler in Israel, whose origin is from of old, from ancient times. Therefore, the Lord will give them up until the time when she who is to give birth has born, and the rest of his brethren shall return to the children of Israel. He shall stand firm and shepherd his flock by the strength of the Lord, in the, majest, in the majestic name of the Lord his God. For they shall remain, for now his greatness shall reach to the ends of the earth. He shall be peace. The word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be, be to God. God. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Romans. Brothers and sisters, we know that all things work for good for those who love God, who are called according to his purpose. 
For those he foreknew, he also predestined to be confirmed in the image of his Son, so that he might be the firstborn among many brothers. And those he predestined, he also called. And those he called, he also justified. And those he justified, he also glorified. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. With, de- with delight, I rejoice in the Lord. With, with delight, delight, I, I rejoice, rejoice in, in the, the Lord. Lord. Though I trusted in your mercy, let my heart rejoice in your salvation. With delight, I trust in the Lord. Let me sing of the Lord. He has been good to me. With delight, I rejoice in the Lord. Father, your blessing. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. Blessed are you, Holy Virgin Mary, deserving of all praise. From you rose the Son of Justice, Christ our God. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory Glory to you, you, Lord. Lord. This is how the birth of Jesus Christ came about. When his mother Mary was betrothed to Joseph, but before they lived together, she was found with child through the Holy Spirit. Joseph, her husband, since he was a righteous man, yet unwilling to expose her to shame, decided to divorce her quietly. Such was his intention when, behold, the angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream and said, Joseph, son of David, Do not be afraid to take Mary, your wife, into your home. For it is through the Holy Spirit that this child has been conceived in her. She will bear a son, and you are to name him Jesus, because he will save his people from their sins. All this took place to fulfill what the Lord had said through the prophet. Behold, the virgin shall be with child and bear a son, and they shall name him Emmanuel which means God is with us. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise Praise to you, Lord Lord Jesus Jesus Christ. Christ. You shouldn't be surprised that the Gospel reading today was not about the birth of Mary. Because nowhere in the Gospels is that account. It was built up over the years, this devotion to Mary in the church, because she was the mother of Jesus. And it began to be celebrated in the church very early. And There are only three people in our history whose birth we celebrate. Jesus, Mary, and John the Baptist those three significant people. But in in Christian tradition, that devotion to Mary was so strong 
that, that they began to talk about how she was born. Joachim and Anna in this, in this legend were, were barren. They couldn't have children and they prayed to God to have a child and God told them that they would have a child and she would be a significant part of the salvation of the world. And of course, she gave birth to, to Jesus, the savior of the world. And now she is queen of heaven and earth. And so we celebrate her birth today. Happy birthday, Mary. Pray for us. Through the intercession of Mary, the mother of Jesus, we pray. Lord bishops, priests, and deacons who labor to faithfully share the good news, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. For those given authority to uphold and enforce the law, that they may respect those they serve and apply the law with justice and compassion, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. For all who suffered painful loss in the tragic events of September 11, that they continue to find comfort in the promise of eternal life, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. For all workers in the vineyard of the Lord, that they find joy and fulfillment in their calling, we pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. For all the men and women who have served and continue to serve our country in the military and for their families and loved ones, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the sick and those who care for them, that they know the compassionate love of Jesus, especially Deacon Rick Pomfrey, Deacon Ed Moser, Joanne Schlemmer, Gabby Short, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all who have died, especially Mary Ellen Greeny, cursed, Betty Mafucci, Benjamin Schrock, and all victims of war and violence, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And for the petitions written in our book of petitions and all the intentions we hold faithfully in our hearts. We pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayers. prayers. Lord, through the intercession of your mother Mary, grant us peace, and holiness, and then hear and answer our prayer according to your will. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. As we blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands, it will become for us the bread of life. Blessed, blessed be, be God, God forever. forever. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. 
will become our spiritual drink. Blessed, Blessed be, God be God forever. forever. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God the Almighty Father. May the, may Lord, the Lord accept, accept this, this sacrifice at, at, your, at your hands, hands for, the, for praise the praise and glory, and glory of, his name, of His name and for the our good, good, of, the good of, of all His Father holy church. church. As we celebrate with joy the Nativity of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we bring you our offerings, O Lord, as we humbly pray to be given strength by the humanity of your Son, who from her was pleased to take flesh, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your and spirit. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift, we lift them, them up, up to, the, to Lord. the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is, it is right, right and, and just. just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation to praise your mighty deeds in the exaltation of all the saints, and especially as we celebrate the memory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, to proclaim your kindness as we echo her thankful hymn of praise. For truly, even to earth's ends, you have done great things and extended your abundant mercy from age to age when you looked on the lowliness of your handmaid and gave us through her the author of our salvation, your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Through him, the host of angels adores your majesty and rejoices in your presence forever. May our voices, we pray, join with theirs in one chorus of exultant praise as we acclaim, Holy, 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 Holy Lord, Lord, God, God of hosts. power. Heaven, Heaven and earth, earth are, are full, full of your, of your glory. glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the, in the name of the Lord. Lord. Hosanna in, in the highest. The highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, and all you have created rightly gives you praise. For through your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, by the power and working of the Holy Spirit, you give life to all things and make them holy. And you never cease to gather a people to yourself, so that from the rising of the sun to its setting, a pure sacrifice may be offered to your name. Therefore, O Lord, we humbly implore you, by the same Spirit, graciously make holy these gifts we have brought to you for consecration, that they may become the body and blood of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, at whose command we celebrate these mysteries. For on the night he was betrayed, he himself took bread, and giving you thanks, he said the blessing, broke the bread, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice. And giving you thanks, he said the blessing and gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me.
The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you you come come again. again. Therefore, O Lord, as we celebrate the memorial of the saving passion of your Son, his wondrous resurrection and ascension into heaven, and as we look forward to his second coming, we offer you in thanksgiving this holy and living sacrifice. Look, we pray upon the oblation of your church, and recognizing the sacrificial victim, by whose death you will to reconcile us to yourself. Grant that we, who are nourished by the body and blood of your Son and filled with his Holy Spirit, may become one body and one spirit in Christ. May he make of us an eternal offering to you, so that we may obtain an inheritance with your elect, especially with the most blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with blessed Joseph, her spouse, with your blessed apostles and glorious martyrs, with St. Patrick and St. John Hughes, and with all the saints, on whose constant intercession in your presence we rely for unfailing help. May this sacrifice of our reconciliation, we pray, O Lord, advance the peace and salvation of all the world. Be pleased to confirm in faith and charity your pilgrim church on earth with your servant Francis, our Pope, Robert, our Bishop, the order of bishops, all the clergy, and the entire people you have gained for your own. Listen graciously to the prayers of this family whom you have summoned before you. In your compassion, O merciful Father, gather to yourself all your children scattered throughout the world. To our departed brothers and sisters and to all who are pleasing to you at their passing from this life, give kind admittance to your kingdom. There we hope to enjoy forever the fullness of your glory through Christ our Lord, through whom you bestow on the world all that is good. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Amen. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Our Father, Father, who art art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy Thy kingdom kingdom come, thy thy will be done, on earth earth as it is in heaven. Give Give us this day our daily bread, and and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And And lead lead us us not into into temptation, but but deliver deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For For the the kingdom, kingdom, the power, and and the the glory glory are yours, now and forever. forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. With your spirit. Let us offer each other a sign of peace. Peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy I'm on you us. Those called Lamb to the of supper God, of the Lamb. you take away the sins of the world. The world. Have, mercy have mercy on us. us. Lamb of God, you take, you take away, away the, the sins, sins of the, of the world. world. Grant have us mercy peace. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. 
Lord, Lord I, I am not worthy, worthy that you, that you should, should enter under my roof, roof but, but only say the word, and I shall be, shall be healed. Amen. Amen. An act of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Let us pray. May your church exult, O Lord, for you have renewed her with these sacred mysteries as she rejoices in the nativity of the Blessed Virgin Mary, which was the hope and daybreak of salvation for all the world. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with, and your, with spirit. your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Thanks, Thanks be, be to God. God.